Now, when we look at counting numbers, like for example, one, two, three, four, five, and so on, these numbers are the same as what we call to be natural numbers. And these natural numbers, which are indeed counting numbers, you notice are also known as positive integers. And positive integers has the positive sign before the number itself. And so, once you have these recognized, uh, for example, positive 1, positive 2, positive 3, positive 4, positive 5, the next part here is the opposite of positive integers, which are known as the negative integers. And negative integers looks at the other side of the number line, which are as follows, where you have negative 1, negative 2, negative 3, negative 4, negative 5, and so on. Take note that all these here, the positive and negative integers, are all called integers. And this here includes 0. And 0 can be positive or negative, but we don't really consider the positive or negative of 0. Therefore, when you place the positive and negative integers on the number line, we start at 0 at the middle and we count from 0 to the right, which is positive 1, positive 2, positive 3, and so on. And why from 0 to the left, we are going to be counting negative 1, negative 2, negative 3, and so on.